Reparations are here. Line up to get your free money. Chicago has already started the handouts for people that were never slaves. But the particular tone of skin color gets them the free money. Now let's take a step back. We don't want to make this into a game or make fun of it. This is serious. We absolutely need to give them the money because they're oppressed. We need to take it from everyone and give it to a very small number of people. But we need to take this seriously. No games. We just need to put a bunch of names into a bingo spinner and make it into a game to see if your name gets picked. Wait, what? It is a game? Oh, crap. They made reparations into a carnival game. Two siblings were picked from the Lucky Lotto machine, and they each get $25,000. There are several requirements to receive the money. Now, since the siblings don't own property, they did not qualify for two of the three repayment options to use the money on a mortgage payment or for home repairs. The third was a down payment for a home, which they also didn't want, so they demanded cash. See, when an oppressed person is given $25,000 of free money and they don't meet the requirements, well, you need to change the rules right away to make sure they aren't more oppressed. Now they're just giving them free cash. Of course, it was always going to be cash, but it'll never be enough. See, Chicago will probably take about 50% in taxes and fees, so they will need to pay more next year. Now, I think this is a good policy for Chicago. You take the money from everyone that has a job and pays taxes, and you give it to the people that don't have jobs, but they feel oppressed. I hope that more unemployed people go to Chicago, and they try their luck with that lotto machine. They should do a drawing every few hours until everyone gets free cash. Well, I mean, not white people and not Asian people, just people affected by slavery. Hey, hold on a minute. No one's been affected by slavery for over 150 years. Ah, who cares? Just give this one group of people more money. Now, we've been giving money to oppressed people for years, like welfare and disability. And all those people are thriving now, so I don't see any harm here at all. Seriously, I don't care about this even a little bit. I can make jokes, but I don't really care. If Chicagoans want to be taxed harder to give money to these people, who am I to stop them? Just be careful when you run out of money or when the taxpayers just decide to leave or stop paying taxes. That should be fun. All right, I got more videos coming later. I'll see you soon.